Hey everyone, it's me Teresa from HealthyVeganLife.com and today I would like to share with you a recipe for a, a mushroom bouillon. This is a special recipe to me because it's one of the dishes that Andy and I served at our wedding. We had a vegan buffet and we had mushroom bourguignon, among other things. Um, but it's just such a comforting dish, um, especially now that the weather is slowly getting colder and it's getting towards autumn. Uh, this is a very, very comforting, pleasant dish. It is completely vegan, of course. Um, we're not going to be using any oil. And um, we're just going to keep it really easy. And prepare it all in one pot because I like to keep it simple so without further ado let's get cooking oh and in case you're curious yes I'm in a new kitchen because we moved for this recipe we will need 500 grams of carrots 500 grams of chestnut mushrooms six shallot onions and about four cloves of garlic Before we start cooking, we'll need to mince the garlic and chop all the vegetables um, into medium-sized chunks. Place one fourth of a cup of water in a medium-sized pan and add your onions and garlic to this. Now we're going to be sautéing the onion and garlic in the water instead of oil and that saves a lot of calories and also will do your body a lot of good. Um, so you're just sautéing it until it is um, slightly more translucent looking. I've sped it up so you can see what it looks like and this works perfectly fine. You don't need any oil whatsoever. Um, after about five minutes we will add our mushrooms and our carrots and this is also the point where we will add all our flavor makers. So we will need one cup of red wine. Now I don't usually drink wine so I had to get a bottle especially for this dish um, but I just got the cheapest wine I could find and that worked perfectly well. And then you'll also want to add one cup of vegetable broth as well as about five sprigs of fresh thyme. You can put the whole sprigs in there or separate the leaves from the stems, it doesn't really matter. And this is just me adding the bouillon to everything and at this point you want to bring everything to a boil and once it's simmering you want to keep it simmering for about 20 minutes. After 20 minutes of simmering all your vegetables should be soft and at this point we want to bind everything together and you can do that by using either two tablespoons of flour that you sift into the um, mushroom bouillon or you could use two tablespoons of corn starch uh, mixed with four tablespoons of water and mix that through everything and then we'll want to add two tablespoons of tomato paste and mix that through really really well and let it simmer for another five minutes until it looks like that and then you're ready to serve all right you guys the meal is done we've got it right here now you can have this um, with anything you want really, you can have it with any kind of grain, people like to eat it with mashed or um, roasted potatoes, some people have it with pasta as well, um, but I just like to have it with rice actually. So um, let's tuck in, here we go, it's really really good and it's so easy. I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe, please give the video a thumbs up if you did. Um, and make it, if you've made it and you've taken a picture of it on Instagram, please tag me. I'm on Instagram um, with the username Teresa Healthy Vegan Life. I'll put a link in the description as well. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys next time. Bye. Oh my god, I need to stop eating this, but it's so good. Mmm.